Hi, Scott from Digital Fish with content that catches and a how-to on catching kingfish from the rocks on Live Piper. You can use this rig for mackerel and yellow-eyed mullet as well. I wouldn't recommend using mainline heavier than 24 kilo as Piper are not very hardy and won't be able to swim for very long. I usually use 60 pound leader as well for the same reason. So I'm just going to run you through my live bait rig for kingfish when using Piper for live bait. Piper are smaller than Kahawai, uh, much more fragile and don't last as long. So you have to change your technique a bit if you want them to be swimming out there long enough for a kingfish to come and find it. First of all, uh, with the live bait hooks, I generally like to use uh, sometimes small jigging hooks, are small and light and strong enough that they don't uh, hinder the Piper from swimming, but also they're strong enough to uh, be able to land kingfish. The Black Magic uh, Gizi live bait 4 bar uh, high carbon steel hooks are also excellent, I'd certainly recommend those. So, live bait hook there, but a 4 bar depends on the size of the piper sometimes. Then with the leader, I generally won't use anything more than 60 or 80 pound strength leader. Anything heavier, it's hard for the piper to drag it around and they die fairly quickly. So I won't use an extremely long leader, maybe a metre and a half, maybe two metres, uh, but that's really long enough for the piper. And then instead of a balloon, we've got just got a small float here, slides up and down, but it can't go any more than about a foot up the line. There's a uh, knot there stopping it from sliding all the way up. You don't want uh, too far away. Then uh, swivel and snap, you can just use one swivel if you want to, tied there. You can use clinch knots, uni knots there. I've used uh, the mini twist, very strong cat's paw connection, and uh, then a clinch knot there. So there's another little trick uh, when live baiting with Piper, um, where you hook them is different from Kahawai, but also there's another little tip that's going to help uh, the Piper stay out there longer and livelier, and I'll show you what to do now. You can hook Piper through the neck, carefully through the skin or through the tail in the anal fin area. Both these places work. So my last tip is very simple, buy some small polystyrene balls about 3cm in diameter, cut a groove halfway through and then push them onto your line as the piper swims away. Do this every 10 meters. This stops the line from sinking into the weed and dragging the piper down. The piper lasts a lot longer this way and are generally uninhibited by the polystyrene floats. Other fish such as snapper will grab a live piper as well, especially in shallow water, so good luck. This is Scott from Digital Fish with content that catches.